Why don't we cover the entire Sahara Desert with solar panels? It could generate 2.5 million terawatt hours of electricity annually, enough to power 96 Earths. However, the installation would have severe consequences, disrupting the climatic cycle and causing the Sahara to become cold. Increased rainfall in the desert could lead to massive ocean cyclones and the Amazon rainforest turning into a desert. It has been observed that rainfall in Sahara Desert causes drought in Amazon region, while lack of rainfall in Sahara accelerates Amazon's growth. It may seem like the two regions are worlds apart, but NASA's Calypso satellite has uncovered a surprising connection. Each year, around 182 million tons of sand dust flies from the Sahara and travels around 4,300 kilometers over the Atlantic Ocean before falling on the Amazon rainforest. This dust carries a substantial amount of phosphorus, which is crucial for rainforest plants to thrive. It's not an exaggeration to say that there is an Amazon because there is a Sahara. 